Let's cover the uh, operation of the live scanner. Obviously you can use the foot pedal. You can go left, you can go right using the, the, the buttons on the pedal, or if you push both of them together, it'll go into what's called the auto scan mode. Okay, that's also called true scan mode. But you can also do that on the remote, and the way you do that is on the remote, if you press the A and the B button at the same time, like this, it will then put it in auto scan mode. So then it will do its 300 degree sweep, which is great for searching, and I'll show you that in another video, but basically the, the nice thing about that is it lets you drive the mo motor, the trolling motor, or wherever you want, and you can automatically scan, look around for stuff. If you're done with that, you hit basically any of the buttons here. You hit A or B, and if I hit the A button, or the A button, like this, and hold it down, it will then move the trolling motor, or, or sorry, the live scanner to the left. If you hit the B button, it'll move the live scanner to the right. So this is your manual mode. So the advantage of that is once you've found the fish using TrueScan, then what you do is you hit the A or the B button, it'll stop the scanner in the right location or near it, and then you'll readjust that to find the, the fish. Now, another feature of this is the, what are called as left scan or right scan. If you hit the D button one time, Okay, like that, it will put it in a right scan mode. Okay, so it will sweep from the center of the troller, center of the uh, live scanner to the uh, to the right. Basically, it's going to do 150 degrees for you. If you hit D twice, then it will start sweeping to the left. So those are some neat features. Those the A and B functions. Those are on the live scanner model, the true scan model, okay? In the original uh, quad scan model, you had the A, B, and the D button, but all these were basically, they were on the remote and they are also on the foot pedal. In the new quad scan plus, you've got all those, plus you've got a really neat function that's called tight scan. I also call it like bait lock. And what you do is you hit the C button, and what it'll do, the last place you scanned, it'll sit there and it'll quiver back and forth, and the neat thing is that if your boat's slightly adjusted, like for example on the St. Lawrence, heavy current will push the boat a little bit around, you know, basically because that's just the way the anchor mode's going to work. It has to continually increase and decrease speed to, to maintain current position. So you hit the C button. So once you want to exit any of these things, just hit the A or B button and everything goes back to normal. So that's, that's your basic operation. There are instructions here. I don't know if you can see that, but these are the instructions that come with it. But I think seeing it's a little bit easier. But the, the idea is that once you get your live scanner, you just simply play the remote and see what it does. And the way you can do that is you actually you can have it on your, on your boat and run it back and forth. Okay, thank you. I appreciate you guys watching this. Please like and subscribe to the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.